OK, one where our z value is not uh, perhaps 0. Well, for t, well, let's go ahead and make this t equals 2. So when ln of 2 equals 0 0.7, 2 times 2 is 4, and e to the 2 is about 7.4. So now we have our x, y, and z values. Let's go ahead and try to plot them. So here's our negative z, z, y, negative y, negative x, and x. Well, so x is 7.4, so let's go ahead and draw that. 7.4 is about here. y is 4. And z is 0 0.7. So drawing these, we have in the xy plane, here, but then we must shift this over uh, by a little bit on the z. So we get something like this. And this is our v of t. So vector functions are, are very useful because uh, they have a direct link to polar coordinates. And also, they can represent something in the 3D space very, very easily by just three components. Um, so this is very, very helpful in some uh, AP Calculus BC topics. For example, in the future, we'll be taking derivatives of our vector functions. Uh, so stay tuned. Until next time, thanks for watching Educator.